Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So a month ago, on the 26th of September, Microsoft started pushing out the Moment 4 feature update for Windows 11, as I posted. And on the same day, they also started rolling out and finalizing the next annual feature update for Windows 11, version 23H2, and that was for insiders in the release preview channel, where it's undergoing its final testing before it makes its way shortly to the stable version. And I'll leave that video down below as well. But just to let you know that a month later now, on the 26th of October, which was yesterday in my region, uh, the 23H2 feature update has received another update in the release preview channel, which is KB5031455. And if that sounds familiar, the same update rolled out to the stable version yesterday, KB5031455. And that pushes up the build for 23H2 to build 22631.2506. And the only difference between that build and the stable versions build is the stable versions build is 22621.2506 and not 2631 as it currently is now in 23H2. Now, my reason for mentioning this uh, this update in release preview for 23H2 is because some are saying that this is one of the smallest updates ever for Windows 11 and only one thing has changed in this release in the release notes where under all apps in the start menu Windows 11 system components will now show a system label and this has already started rolling out to Windows 10 as I posted on earlier today so with w Windows 11 23H2, obviously we will get the same where File Explorer, Game Bar and so on will have a system label uh, showing that they are system components and not normal apps, so to speak. Now, this is also another indication and um, because Microsoft has only rolled out one small little improvement with this update to the release preview channel where we are and where they are finalizing 23H2 is another indication that obviously uh, the lid is almost on that feature update and it's going to be rolling out shortly and um, if it doesn't roll out next tuesday the 31st i'm sure we wish we should start seeing it on the 14th which will be patched tuesday the second tuesday of november and over and above that small improvement where um, system components labels are now in the all apps in the start menu um, it also includes all the fixes and improvements that rolled out uh, with the stable version with the same update as I posted on earlier today. So if you are interested in all those fixes, I'll leave that video down below as well. And there's a lot going on, very similar similar things happening now in preview and stable. And that's because uh, a lot of the so-called original 23H2 features rolled out with the Moment 4 feature update and have rolled out already to Windows 11 version 22H2. So that's why there's a lot of overlapping with features. And as I've mentioned previously, 23H2 will not be as big an update or as large an update as the Moment 4 update would be. And it will include a couple of new features, but won't be as near as large as 20, sorry, as Moment 4, because Moment 4 included approximately 150 new features. But nonetheless, just putting it out there, just another indication that that 23H2 feature update is almost here. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.